Hi, hello, my lovely what are you doing? Today I'm going to introduce you to a case that can be attached to your iPad and the Magic Keyboard. Let's get to it. So for those of you who use the iPad for different purposes like me, who use the Magic Keyboard to type and go through documents or remove it from the Magic Keyboard and use it bare bone or naked or whatever you want to call it to draw or take notes, you're very careful because you don't have a case or a cover that goes on the back side. But if you do have a case, you can't attach it to the Magic Keyboard. That's the problem with most cases, right? I found this handy dandy little cover that can be attached to the Magic Keyboard and also protect your iPad. It's called Cover Buddy. So what you do is you take this and then just attach it to your iPad Pro or whatever model you have. And this itself goes on to the Magic Keyboard like this. So it gets attached. When you take it off, you don't have to worry about the back part of your iPad being scratched or getting damaged when it's detached from the Magic Keyboard. One thing that was I was a little surprised was that it doesn't cover the full iPad itself. It does have a little bit of exposure right here, but this part I'm not too worried about because it does go under the bottom part of the Magic Keyboard when it's attached. One thing I really like about this is that it has a little place right here where your Apple pencil can also be kind of like snuck in right there and your pencil is hiding just safely right in here. Usually if you just have the magic keyboard your pencil is exposed and it's just magnetically connected to the top of the iPad so you can lose it unless you carry it in a pouch or a case. However with this with the cover buddy you can just have it here like this and remove the Apple Pencil whenever you need and just use it like that. I love the fact that this protects the iPad and can also be attached to the Magic Keyboard. But here's the downside. There's always pros and cons. The case itself doesn't actually fit perfectly. Doesn't actually have that tight, perfect fit fit to the iPad Pro. There are certain areas that you do feel a little bit as if it's a little bit loose, like in places like this, where it's just like, it bends just a little bit. It's a little bit loose in certain areas. And another thing is because of the shape of this part right here, it's a little bit difficult to control the volume and press the volume buttons this part that sticks out right here, this part right here that sticks out, it covers the volume buttons. So it's a little bit difficult to press the volume buttons when you're viewing something. And it's a little bit difficult to press the power button as well. I guess the case kind of sticks out just a little too much, uh, but if you really get your finger in there, like you really get your finger in there and press the power button, then it's fine. And if you don't mind that part, then everything else is really good. Everything else is really good. I really like the structure. I really like the build. It's not like super solid because obviously it's plastic. Another thing that I'm just a little bit, you know, on the, mm, I wish this kind of fit like perfectly is that when you close the magic keyboard, you have a little bit of a space right here. So there is that little, I don't know, there's a little bit of a space where it feels like the magic keyboard is kind of like floating in the air just a little tiny bit, especially if you put it this way, you can see that there's a little bit of space right here, but that really doesn't bother me because I carry this around in a pouch. So I guess it's, pretty okay. Uh, using it though, I like the fact that it protects. I like the fact that it fits. I like the fact that it has a place for my pencil. It's just that there are little tiny places here and there. I wish they could have done and made a little bit better. So if you have an iPad and you're using the Magic Keyboard and you would like something that protects your iPad, especially the back side of your iPad, 
and your Apple Pencil, I suggest go grabbing one of these. I got mine here on Naver.com. Um, I searched for it and got it for Haman Chichonon or something like that. So it is a little bit on the side where you do have to kind of invest. It's not cheap, but I think it's a reasonable price. I hope that helped. I'll see you next week. Bye. I'm not wearing any makeup today because I have really bad severe acne and I was told not to wear makeup until all this medicine and all this treatment stuff is all done and over with. I apologize for having this kind of face, but please bear with me.